Hi everybody, Debbie Adams here. Before I get started with my quick little demo, I want to first wish Mary Beth Shaw a happy birthday and um, to wish uh, Stencil Girl happy 10 year anniversary, woohoo! We are so proud of the company they are and the integrity behind them and the community they've developed, so we're happy to celebrate with them. Today I thought I would um, maybe show a technique that Mary Beth hasn't shown us yet and she has shown us so many. So today I thought I would show you how to um, do gold leafing with your stencils. So today I've watercolored my substrate. I used Arches watercolor paper, but you can also use something that's a gel print or something that you've got in your stash box. You don't have to create a special um, backdrop for this. And then I'm using Mary Beth's barbed wire. I absolutely love this. I don't know what it is about that. So um, to get started, I sprayed the back with this pixie spray because I want this to adhere. Now I know when you use uh, some of the watercolor paper, particularly this Arches paper, it is a little rough. So it has a hard time um, staying put. But if I can just get it tacky enough kind of to stay in place, that's, that's perfect for me. So this is what I've done there. And then I'm going to use um, some adhesive, but you can also use for the gold leafing, you can also use this metal leafing adhesive. It's made specifically for gold leafing. Um, I've used glue and it's worked just fine for me. So that's what I'm gonna use today. Um, and all you do is just spread this on your stencil, like so. Move it around. And it's not gonna be exactly perfect unless you want to make it um, very specific and use like a stencil, stencil brush. You can pounce it up and down. Obviously that's gonna get you a more um, defined markings or you can kind of spread it like I'm doing because I really just want um, the circles that are on here. And so just go ahead and paint that on around with your glue. And then if you're using the stencil or the um, gold leafing adhesive, they do ask that after you put this on that you wait about half an hour before um, applying your gold leafing. It gives it time to kind of like settle in and be less uh, runny, a little more tacky. So I got mine just about done and I'm gonna let this dry for a second and then we'll be able to put on the gold leafing. Let me peel this off. Okay, so now my glue should be just about dry and um, I'm going to use my gold leafing. Now, if any of you used this before, you can buy this at a hobby store. It comes um, in little sheets and they're very, very thin and they like to stick to your skin. So if you're a finger person like I am, you can put it on with your fingers, but if you don't want to waste and you don't want to get it stuck all over there, you can use a pair of tweezers. And I'm going to go ahead and put that on in. I think I'm going to use my whole hand because I've got this image all over this piece on here. And it never bothers me if it kind of crinkles up like that um, because it's gonna get moved around anyway. And then you just pat that on there and all the places obviously that the glue is at for the stencil will show and the rest will be brushed away. So we're gonna let that dry. And that should be about it. Now we're ready to just brush it away. And when you place it, the glue, that will leave that imagery and I can see it coming through already. This is a little messy, so obviously you might wanna do this over the trash can. Don't use one of your best brushes either because it's gonna get a little junked up a little bit. And there you go. And I think that's perfect. Needs a little more brushing off. And there's my beautiful art. I'm ready to put it in a frame or maybe put some sort of sentiment on there. But I kind of like it the way it is. It's the new modern look. I've got a lot of shibori in my house with little gold accents. I think that's perfect. So there you go, my little tip and trick. I'm sure Mary Beth will be able to do something more with this. But this is just a way to get started and something a little different. <laughs> 